the first lesson or the first part of our unit, unit number eight. The amazing oh, no, bird wait, around. Uh, three minutes. Again? Wait three minutes of the. Okay, it's all right. It's all right. Okay. So, hello to you. Let me start. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, today we will talk about the first lesson or the first part of our unit, the amazing bird around us. So, from the title, the amazing word around us. We get at that this unit will talk about the words around us. Let's take a look of some of the key vocabs that we will uh, meet in service. First, we have bridge, and this is a model for the bridge. We can find also in Egypt, Tahamas Bridge. Very good. And this is a model of the city. Pyramid, and we have in Giza three pyramids, tower, and this is crowded. So all the cities have some places which are always crowded, and you can find, especially Bangkok in China, it's very, very crowded as you can see in this picture. And buildings, the city as you can see in the city of the picture, it has many buildings like this building over here. So this is a view for, can you guess where am I? Or can you guess this please, or this country? Correct, this is the Cairo Tower, or Cairo Tower, where you can see this beautiful view for Cairo. And these are some other vocabs like country. This is the country of Egypt. Population, which are the people in each country, each place. The capital, which is the center or the city that has all the government relations or related uh, buildings. 
or associations in it. And this is Brazil or Brazil, Brazil. And this is Bangkok. And here you can find the tunnel. The tunnel is an underground passage for cars, trains, sometimes people. Some famous places. Tahi is a new Tahi Mast Bridge, a, the Codard Tunnel in Switzerland, and this is the Shanghai Tower. It's just a beautiful tower. Can you guess where can you see this beautiful view? Okay, let me give you a hint. It's in China. Did you guess? Did you guess it? Correct. This is Bangkok. Bangkok Tower. Okay. So here we have a small quiz. The space of Bangkok is in Thailand is about 10 million people. Here I'm talking about the people. So the correct answer would be population or pollution. Correct, it will be population. Meter, centimeter, and kilometer are lengths. Measurements or tunnels, of course not tunnels, it's measurements. We use it to measure distance. The underground goes through a long, a long what, cave? You can find the caves in mountains, but under the ground you can find good tunnels. China is very, there are many people there. It's very what? Many people crowded. So now, coming to the important part. Comparative and superlative adjectives. Comparative adjectives, you can find it uh, comparing two people or two things. Let's take a look over here. Comparative adjective. For most adjective with one or two syllables, uh, we aid ER is aided to make the comparative. For example, Ahmed is tall. When we add ER, Ahmed is taller. Now we add also Zan, Jonathan. For another example, Dean is stronger than Carlos. So this is comparative comparing between two people. Pi Fahrenheit is colder than 85 Fahrenheit. Of course, so you can see 85 Fahrenheit is higher than Pi Fahrenheit. Emma is older than Sharon. As you can see, Emma is 92 years old. A plan or play a plane is faster than a train, and that is also fact. So J is younger than Tina, as you can as you can see. This is J and this is Tina. My friends are quicker than me, so that all these models uh, bring me back to our rule: adjective plus er plus that. So let's take another look. What else do we have? Of course, there are different rules for forming comparative depending on the ending of symbol form of the adjective. For example, the adjective close, say closer, early, earlier, big, bigger. All of these still regular adjectives. They don't change, they keep their form. Let's take a look over here. We have lazy, lazier, happy, happier, easy, easier. So from here I can extract that the adjective ends goes Y. And before it we have a consonant letter. So when I change it to a comparative, I will omit the Y or remove the Y and change it to I. Then we add the ER. Big bigger, 
hot, hotter. So, adjective that has one syllable. Big, hot. I repeat the last letter twice. Big, bigger, hot, hotter. Okay, as for verbs that ends with E, there is an E, so I don't need to add another E plus R. No, I just add the R like large, larger, close, closer. Now coming to the big adjectives or the long adjective. For some two syllables adjective and adjective with three syllables or more, we use more plus than are used to make the comparative. Let's take a look. This beach is more beautiful than that one. So I didn't change beautiful. Beautiful is still the same. I just added before it more. Another time, this beach is less beautiful than that one. So, the Hi. beach. Uh, hello, Mariam. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, so we're still talking about the comparative adjective. We finished the regular adjectives, and now we are talking about the long adjective, like beautiful. So beautiful, I can't add more syllable to it. So what I do is before it, but I put more or less. More when I say when I want to, it's better or more. This beach is more beautiful than that one. Here, I can also say this beach is less. Beautiful than that one too. Here we have some other models. Spiders are more frightening than wasps or bees. Uh, for me, history is less difficult than science. Can you read the last four example, Mariam? Yeah. Okay, go on. Spiders are more frightened than wasps. Wasps or bees? For me? For me, history is least difficult than science. Very good. Okay, can you read the last example? This one over here. The dress more glamorous than I expected. Than I expected. Very good. So if you notice that you will see the adjective like frightening, interesting, glamorous, difficult, tiring, or exciting, we didn't add anything to it. We added before it another adjective which is less or more, unlike the regular or the short adjectives. Also, we have some irregular adjectives like bad. The comparative form for it is worse. Far is further or farther. Good, better. Later, uh, late, later or later. Little, less, many or much. We change it with more. So now we also have a tricky adjectives. Two form adjective. Adjective that can have the long form adjective and the short form adjective, like narrow will be narrower or more narrow, shallow will be shallower or more shallow, simple will be more simpler, more simple or simpler, quieter will be more quieter too, easy uh, or works in both ways, live. Liveler or more lively, angry, angrier or more angry. And I think that's all of the adjectives that can work in both ways. Coming to the superlative. Superlative is when you compare one with all. For example, horses are faster than ducks. That is true. But cheetahs are the fastest land animals. So 
this adjective fast. I ate it before, uh, before it, the, and after it, the EST. Right? Let's look at another example. Can you read them, Marion? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Giraffes. Birds are animals yes. in the world. In the world, great. Number two. Don't birds are the la largest animals in the world. Very good. Slothers are the slowest animal in the zoo, and dolphins are the smartest animals in the world. So here we have the adjective like close, early, big. And now we are giving it a superlative form, which will be closest, earliest, and biggest. And here back to our beautiful table. Lazy, lazier, and laziest. Happy, happier, happiest. Easy, easier, easiest. Big, bigger, biggest. Hot, hotter, hottest. Large, larger, largest. Fit, fitter, fittest. So all we aid the EST at the end. And here we are talking about the long adjective, which are the adjective that has two syllables or more. For example, uh, expensive, or uh, beautiful, or exhausted. Before it, we eat the most, like this example over here. The motorcycle is more expensive than the scooter. But the sports car is the most expensive vehicle. So I'm comparing the vehicle with all of the rest. Also, I can say the scooter is less, is the least expensive vehicle. And here we have our rules. I can say this is the most or the least, if I want it to be the best or the worst, expensive, the adjective we have, and then the rest of the sentence, dish on the menu, or motorcycle or car. Like, for example, the Science Museum is the most interesting museum in town. And this is the least comfortable chair in the room. Madam, can you read the, the last two? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Mm, this is a list. Yes. This is a, this is a list. Com comfor comfortable chair in the yeah. room. Great. Okay, next one is the twister. The twister is the most exciting read in the good. read in the same park. Very good. Okay, teacups are. Go ahead. Teacups are. The last enjoyable read in the same park. Very good. Teacups are the least enjoyable wide in the theme park. OK. So also we have some irregular adjective. We do it here, the adjective, comparative form, and superlative form. Bad, worse, the worst. Far, farther, or farther, the farthest, or the first. Good, better, the best. Late, later, later, or the last, or the little, less, the least, many and much, more, the most. So, here we have a, ten, a question quiz. Okay, uh, Mariam, uh, you can read and choose the right answer. I think that also held than money. More, uh, more important. Very good, more important.
I can't carry my suitcase much. They are yours. Okay, I have than. Heavier. Heavier, good. You look then. Um, health, sir. Here, Healthier. number two. Good job. Higher, number B. Number two. Mountains are higher than health. Shotgun. Then, what's the more? And yes. number three? More dangerous. You should go to the doctor. Your cold is more dangerous than it was a few days ago. Yesterday was day of the year. I almost lost the dice and making a hand from the cold. Could. I should. The, the coldest. The coldest because I'm comparing this day with all of the year. I have ever eaten the most very good, the most delicious cake I have ever eaten. I'm comparing this cake with all the cakes I have eaten before. Bob told story last night. I couldn't stop laughing. The fu uh, funniest number P. Very good. The funniest. For our animal in the world. Pick, uh, the the pick. whales. The biggest. Very good. Miles uh, liver in the pool. Okay. And the longest should, should be the longest. Very good. Okay, this should be it. I'll thank you again, Mariam, for your participation, and I'll send you the homework uh, in the group. All right? Okay. Okay, I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye bye.